welcome to the Bermuda Triangle from the inside perspective. So we decided to take a new perspective that the Bermuda Triangle could be a sanctuary for someone, could be a place for people that are lost, could be somewhere that you get to escape the woes of everyday life, and um, it's actually a sanctuary for everyone. Coming into college, um, growing going through Rush, I definitely didn't think I'd be part of like a musical experience like this. Being part of a new environment that I wasn't previously used to has just been really cool. It's been a really cool experience. The performing has been something that's always been a part of my life, and I came to college thinking that that wasn't going to be it anymore. You know, I came in as a business major. Um, the university saves me a chance to have fun, you know, leave everything at the door and get to be a part of something that's bigger than myself. I think one of the coolest things about um, you saying has been how the directors have made it a priority that they know that we know that they're there for us. The part that's been my favorite to see is how much everyone cares for it. At the end of the day, we have nothing to prove, only to share. The University of Saint to me is abstract because it's different. Um, there's a lot of different aspects that kind of make it what it is, but in the end, it's something that's just so different and that I think everybody can appreciate. I'm pumped. It's going to be a good time. I know all the other guys in here and all the girls in here are ready to do it all. We're ready. We're really ready. It's going to be a good time. Bermuda Triangle. Their lives turn upside down when their plane is suddenly caught in a mysterious vortex and is forced to make an emergency landing. What happens to this unforeseen duo? Is the triangle really as bad as legends say? What will they learn in this mysterious place? Find out in the Bermuda Triangle. <laughs>
right, everyone. You know the drill. We've done this a million times before. Boys, make sure those triangles are straight. Yes, ma'am. Oh, new friends, new friends. Here come new friends. Tim, would you please calm down? Take a deep breath. <gasps> I have an idea. We light the forest on fire. It's no fire! Yes, you're right, so the fire's like a terrible idea. Let's go simple this time. <clears throat> Just a banner that says, Welcome to Bermuda, a paradise for those needing escape. And in really fine print on the bottom, no, you're not dead. Classic, <laughs> short and to the point. Oh crap, here they come. No time for the banner, just smile and wave, boys, smile and wave. Steve, where are you going? The plant's back here. As if my life was already terrible enough, let's add Don on a deserted island to the list. There has got to be a way out of that. Where are you joking, though? How do you do? The Bermuda Triangle? Fascinating. Ha! Hola, Bermuda! What a wonderful- Tim! My name is Tallulah, and welcome to our secret piece of heaven on earth. Our people come from all over to escape the problems of their everyday lives. There's no stress, no hunger, no fighting, and no time. Oh, and you're not dead! So that's why nobody ever comes back. It's perfect here! You got it! You ever wonder where Amelia Earhart, Tupac, and Michael Jackson went? <laughs> hey, Michael. That's right, the Bermuda Triangle! And you are? Mr. Tim. Wait, so you're telling me I get to escape all of my problems as eternal paradise? Precisely. <laughs>
But how? Uh, what if we build a boat? Becky, you're a biologist, not an engineer. How are we gonna build a boat? A boat for what? We have to go home. Aww. We really just can't be my home anymore. What, you're leaving me? It's not you, it's... Uh, it's... the top of Obergard. She has to continue her research. Right. It's okay, you two. We understand. I most certainly do not! Tim, you have people to return to, other places to see. Just because Bermuda's our home doesn't mean it has to be yours. Thank you, Tulula, but we still don't have a way out of here. About that, you do know your plane never actually crashed, right? Just something about a vortex and the triangle. The captain, because your plane all gassed up and ready to go. Well, if that's so, then I guess we're off then. 